Imagine a river, not of water, but of whiskey, blazing through the streets of Dublin, Ireland. That was the reality in 1875. Welcome to a bizarre chapter of history, one that seems almost too strange to be true. In the heart of Dublin, on the 18th of June, 1875, disaster struck. The Malone's Distillery on Chamber Street was bustling as usual, but on this fateful day, something went terribly wrong. A spark ignited the whiskey vapors, setting off a fire that would soon become infamous. The inferno was fierce, consuming everything in its path, but it was not the flames that were most deadly. As the fire raged, it burst the distillery tanks, sending a flaming river of whiskey cascading through the streets. It was a surreal sight, flames dancing on liquid fire, flowing through the cobblestone streets of the city. Now, here comes the tragic twist. The residents of Dublin, perhaps driven by desperation or the sheer oddity of the event, began to scoop the whiskey from the gutters. Some even used boots and hats to collect it. It was free whiskey after all, but it was also a deadly trap. The toll was not from burns or smoke, no, 13 people succumbed to alcohol poisoning. The climax of this story isn't marked by the quenching of flames, but by the sobering aftermath. The community, the city, and even the world learned a harsh lesson about the dangers of indulgence and the unpredictable nature of disasters. Reflecting on this incident, we see not just a tale of fire and whiskey, but a story of human nature, resilience, and unfortunately, fun. It prompts a question. What would you do if you saw whiskey flowing down the street? If you found this story as intriguing as I did, consider subscribing to Uncovered Enigmas for more tales that sit on the stranger side of history. Peace.